Hi there, I have two little envelopes that I like to cut and pounce the score lines so that I can fold them neatly. And I'm going to show you how to pounce the lines and cut at the same time so that it doesn't take any time at all really to get this done. So all you're going to do is double click. I'm going to score the pink lines. I'm going to double click on this to select them all. I'm going to double click up here in this box. It's going to select the pink. I'm going to tell it to pounce it. I'm going to tell it to pounce five by seven. I set that increment by saving the default for the control as point zero one zero. And you can do that by right clicking on the arrows and resetting your default as well. I'm going to click add or change, it doesn't matter, same thing happens. And there I have the pounce lines. And thereafter, anything that I add to this screen or add to this palette in this color, in this pink, will also be pounced. If I add something in black, it's not going to pounce, just the pink. So you know. Okay, we're going to click these and get rid of them. And now that it's done, basically I would just send it to cut, click cut, and it will cut everything at once. But like most people, what I've done is I've drawn the envelopes first and then added the score lines. So probably what you want to do is change the sequence of the cut so it scores first and then cuts the outline. So click Layout, Sequence, Sequence by List, and make sure, I've already done this of course, make sure that your out exterior lines appear at the top so that they cut last. And This means basically it's kind of reversed. This means that your score lines will cut first and the exterior lines will actually cut closed last. And there you go. We're all done.